Hello everyone, my name is Hal. This is Quail Studios Guitar. We are talking about half bars. I've got two other videos. At the end of this video, I will put those videos on the screen so you can click on them. I guess I could put it right up there in the corner and, and you can click on it. Let's just get right into it. We talked about half bars, minors and majors, and we talked about where the notes are on the E string. So let's talk about how to add a bass note onto that. We've got our open E. We did this a little earlier. We got three notes. The third string, the second string, and the first string open. And we can add our low E string with it. That's an E minor chord. If you put your finger on the first fret G string, you get a major chord. Pretty nice. Now, if I move that up, let's, let me get my capo here just for a second. Uh, let's go to the first fret. The first fret is an F note on the E string. If I play my open strings, that's an F minor. And if I go like this, that's an F major chord, just like when we did the open E. Now, if I just use my finger all the way across, and I just put a bar there like this, and one of the secrets to the bar is that, now I'm going to face the camera. You'll notice that my guitar is off at an angle. And also, my elbow is touching my ribs like this. My arm is coming straight out from my body. And then I just put my finger up here. And I play on this side of my finger, not on, not on the flat part right there, but on the side of my finger, like that. Right? And I'm playing the low E string and the G, B, and E strings right there. Now when I take this finger and I put it on the G string, one fret up from the bar, I'm making a major chord. And I can move that around. I'm all the way up on the 12th fret now. So if I do the bar with no other fingers down except the bar, and I play the low E string and those three higher strings, I got a minor chord. And if I put this finger down on the G string, one fret above that bar, then I have a major chord. Major, minor, major, minor. And you can play songs like this. It's really great. Let's see if I have a song here. Fields of Gold by Sting. You'll remember me when the west wind moves among the fields of holly. Eva Cassidy, or Eva Cassidy, how do you say that? She did this song in E minor. You'll remember me when the west wind moves among the fields of holly. So what we do is we play the open E, that's an E minor chord, you remember me, and then we go to a C chord, which is on the 8th fret, when the west wind moves, among, and then we go up to D, which is two frets higher, on the 10th fret, the fields, and then we go down to G, which is the 3rd fret, Abali. and then E minor again, open, you can tell the sun in his jealous sky when we walked a minor fifth fret just the bar cross walked in fields d 10th fret of gold it's a little low for my voice uh, i think it's really good for a woman's voice and for a low man low man's voice so she took her love for to gaze a while among the fields of barley. E minor, in his arms she fell. That's the open. Eighth fret, as her hair came down among A minor, the fields D major of gold. Third fret. So there you go. There's a song that you can do with just bar chords. Find one of your favorite songs. 
and play it with just these half bar chords. It'll be great. You'll learn your bar chords, you'll learn where they are. You can play just about any song that way. And uh, you'll be working on your bars and your notes on the E string and have fun with it. All right, thanks for coming along. My name is Hal, this is Quail Studios Guitar. All right, we'll talk to you later. Have a good day. Bye. Thank you.